How is that possible? What do you say when I ask you about the most memorable Christopher Nolan movie? Is it The Dark Knight with the amazing Heath Ledger Joker? Is it Interstellar with its realness in science? Or is it Dunkirk, Oppenheimer, Inception, Memento? Ugh, oh, too many good movies. This year it will be 12 and somewhat years ago, The Dark Knight Rises hit record heights at the box office, even surpassing The Dark Knight and becoming Nolan's highest grossing movie of all time. That was good, can you make that next time as well? That's also what can happen when something is well received. The Dark Knight Rises benefited from being a sequel to The Dark Knight and being the last installment of the series. The Dark Knight set up an unprecedented fan anticipation for The Dark Knight Rises. And as a simple bonus, it was a Batman project. And only the people who live under a rock don't know who Batman is. But still, for example, how did a hype movie like Oppenheimer not get the same results or even better? Not that The Dark Knight Rises was bad or anything, it's just not seen as the number one favorite Nolan movie. Ah, here. It had positive reviews, positive word of mouth, and more hype because it was a Nolan movie. Oh yeah, and then there was something that was both improving and destroying Oppenheimer's box office numbers. I think that summarizes why The Dark Knight Rises is still Nolan's biggest box office success.